We are down in South Louisiana. At my parents' house. Sarah's neck of the woods. And we're doing what the first thing you gotta do when you come to South Louisiana. Beignets. We're having beignets for breakfast. You excited about the beignets? He's wearing his South Louisiana outfit, camo, which I don't normally allow. <laughs> but his Papa Shark bought it for him. So he's wearing it. But it's now cold yeah, outside. It, it, so it went from real hot to all of a sudden it's, change it's chilly out here. We came out, we're like, oh my gosh. <laughs> anyway, we're going to go put on our beignet clothes, the baby beignet clothes. I don't know. I kind of messed that sense. up. Anyway, let's go. <laughs> alligators in the back because it's South Louisiana there's alligators in the back <laughs> There he is. Two of them. You see the alligators? Yep. Gabriel, do you see the alligators? Do you see Wally Gator? Nope. Yeah, I am an alligator. Oh. Growls all the time. Of course he would growl. <laughs> Except when he's on camera. Oh. That's a crawfish hole, in case you were curious. You ever heard the name mud bugs? That'd be why. That's where they live. Down that hole. An old blacksmith shop. Gabriel back home to my parents' house so he could take a nap because he was getting pretty fussy. He was not as charmed by the Cajun village as we always are. So now he's up from the nap. We're back in the car. We are actually en route to our next Louisiana adventure. We're going to go see the bonfires before they're lit. So there is a tradition on every Christmas Eve they light bonfires along the levee of the river. I don't know what river, Mississippi? No. Nope. <laughs> no, it's not the Mississippi. Maybe we'll look that up and Jacob will put it like right here, what river it is, because I didn't look it up before this. But people build these really elaborate bonfire setups, and you'll see what those look like here shortly, but we're on our way to that. This is always something really fun that we do that Jacob always likes. Um, my parents have a couple of times actually gone to the burning of the bonfires, but that's on Christmas Eve. Actually, I think they went last year because we didn't come back home for Christmas because I was pregnant. But usually Christmas Eve is the time we spend with a, a, my family. So we don't get to go and see them actually burning the bonfires. But we like to go and see them being built, which they're really cool and elaborate. So that's what we're on our way to now. So 
See that levee? It is in fact the Mississippi River. Jacob. I was wrong. <laughs> I thought it was. But yes, that is the mighty Mississippi. Bonfire. Oh, I didn't get it. No. Okay, wait. Now it's bonfire time. So hold on. Now some of them are covered because they want to keep them dry. Obviously, it's been a little rainy. You can see folks are still working on them. I guess the saran wrap is also to keep it dry. Yeah. He's got his four wheeler. Ooh. <laughs> now the there's one coming up. Oh look, they painted theirs. Okay. Yeah, they paint the ends of them. Here comes the one that's painted. See, that one's painted. I like it. This one, they put this crap on it so it'll burn brighter. Which I think it looks stupid, but not my bonfire. A little one. A medium one. So what they'll do is on Christmas Eve night, they will burn these and there will be big parties everywhere. So the houses across the way will host parties. Usually the houses across the way are, belong to the bonfire sometimes. And they'll have big parties and invite all of their friends and family and watch the bonfires. <laughs> So Jacob and my dad are out walking the levees. You can't see it through the window. Looking at the bonfires, but it is muddy and we have a baby and I doubt a stroller can go up the levee. So mom and I and Gabriel are hanging out in the car while they do that. So every year there's always one that really goes all out that everybody has to take a picture of. It's been making the rounds on Facebook. It looks, it's a, it's a big snapping turtle. So we're walking up to this one right now. Get back unless the bonfire's lit. That's why we make all these bonfires for Santa can find his way back. Especially if it gets real cloudy. How do you find Rudolph it? Rudolph got to lead the way. <laughs> now you got turtles? If Rudolph's nose go out, I got to go get some batteries. Oh, 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 turtles. Yes, indeed. Merry Christmas, boys and girls. Oh, uh, now I'm stuck. You like a turtle daddy? I like turtles. driving because we've gone to two different restaurants so far and the first was closed and the second when we pulled in my dad said he had a better one for us to go to so we're still trying to find a restaurant he is the king of finding random good food places so now we're driving out like there's bayou on either side of us can't see it but this next restaurant is supposed to be very scenic so <laughs> hopefully we get to eat soon
as usual, Gerald did not disappoint. Yeah, that's what I want. And now they're arguing about what they're going to get. See, he, he always wants to tell you what you want. What's the last time you had? I'm going to have the crab tea. <laughs> I'm having a shrimp po' boy. What are you going to have? He's going to have tender, tender chicken and stars. <laughs> That's what it is. Crab teeny and baked potatoes. Daddy's having an eggplant. Napoleon. Napoleon. I'm having barbecue shrimp. That one's looking at it. <laughs> shrimp po' boy. Like most parents, the nights leading up to Christmas, we're wrapping presents. Show them the presents we have to wrap, Jacob. And please note. Those are not for Gabriel, they're for my nephews. Yeah, they're for other family members. <laughs> and I'm wrapping some too. I'm wrapping the ones for the boys. The ones that will not admire the wrapping job and just tear into the presents. <laughs> so, <laughs> we're home, wrapping. <clears throat> and I'm gonna split the weekend video into two. Cause we've got a lot of footage from today. So this will be up tomorrow, Christmas Eve. Um, uh, if you liked this video, Give it a thumbs up. Be sure to comment and make sure to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. We appreciate y'all watching. Thank you very much and we'll see you guys on Christmas Day. Alright, bye-bye.